Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Happy Days burst onto the American television scene, captivating audiences across the nation. The show featured a cast of characters and actors who would soon become familiar faces in millions of households. However, despite the undeniable success of Happy Days, the path to that triumph wasn't always smooth. At the heart of the show was Ron Howard, portraying the character of Richie Cunningham, the son of Howard and Marion Cunningham. Richie was not only a beloved figure but also a close friend to characters like Potsy, Ralph, and the iconic Fonzie, played by the talented Henry Winkler. In the initial stages, Richie was positioned as the main character, but the show's dynamics underwent a significant shift, placing the spotlight firmly on Fonzie. As the popularity of Fonzie grew, the producers contemplated a bold move, changing the title of the show to focus solely on the leather jacket-clad motorcycle-riding character. This idea, however, was met with resistance, particularly from Ron Howard. The thought of altering the essence of Happy Days to center around Fonzie was enough to make Howard consider leaving the series altogether. Happy Days had become a cultural phenomenon, and its success was attributed to the chemistry among the cast, the relatable characters, and the nostalgic setting. The idea of sidelining Richie, who had been the show's original focal point, and rebranding it as a Fonzie-centric series, did not sit well with many involved in the production. In the end, the proposal to change the title was abandoned, and Happy Days continued with its winning formula, featuring a balanced ensemble cast. Fonzie remained a central character, but the show retained its core charm by keeping a diverse group of characters in the spotlight. This decision proved to be a wise one, as Happy Days continued to be a beloved show, leaving an indelible mark on television history. And so, thanks to the resilience of its original concept and the dedication of its talented cast, Happy Days continued to bring joy and nostalgia to viewers, ensuring its lasting place in the hearts of fans around the world. Ron Howard, born Ronald William Howard on March V, 1954, in Duncan, Oklahoma, is an acclaimed American filmmaker and actor. His early life was marked by a deep immersion into the world of entertainment, guided by supportive parents and an early start in the entertainment industry. Ron's parents, Gene Spiegel Howard and Rance Howard, were both aspiring actors. In 1958, the Howard family relocated to Burbank, California, where Ron's father Rance found work in the entertainment industry. This move to the heart of the film and television industry would play a crucial role in shaping Ron's future. Ron Howard's career in the spotlight began at a very young age. He made his acting debut at just 18 months old in a film called Frontier Woman. Throughout the 1960s, he appeared in various television shows, building a reputation as a talented and versatile child actor. However, it was in 1974 that Ron Howard gained widespread recognition for his role as Richie Cunningham in the hit television series, Happy Days. The show became a cultural phenomenon, and Howard's portrayal of Richie endeared him to audiences across the country. Even during his acting career, Ron Howard demonstrated an interest in filmmaking. In 1977, he directed his first feature film, Grand Theft Auto showcasing his talent behind the camera. As the years progressed, Howard continued to balance his acting career with his growing passion for directing. Ron Howard's transition from child actor to respected filmmaker is a testament to his talent and dedication. Over the years, he has directed a wide range of successful films, including Apollo 13, A Beautiful Mind, and The Da Vinci Code. His achievements in both acting and directing have earned him numerous accolades, making Ron Howard a prominent figure in the world of entertainment. Thanks for watching, like, share, and subscribe for more.